Many Vermonters are still recovering from the historic flooding that devastated our region last summer. Some of them are getting a new boost though. Today, a coalition called the Vermont Volunteer Organization's Active in Disaster got nearly a half million dollars worth of household goods to help people most impacted by the floods. NBC5's Adrian Pastor is live now in Berlin. And Adrian, it sure sounds like those donations will be a big help. Yeah, Jack, that's exactly right. Believe it or not, there are still folks who don't even have kitchens ever since July's historic floods. And these organizations have been working for the slow progression of a long-term recovery effort. Now today, dozens of volunteers came out to go through these everyday items that are going to help these Vermont families in need. Tractor trailers carried household goods like refrigerators, kitchens, tables, chairs, and even bedroom sets to Berlin. The group unloading the nearly half a million dollar donation from the Compassion Coalition in Utica, New York. Daniel Molin has been on the front lines of providing some relief and he says that the latest donation is expected to help families still working to get back to normal. You know everybody is sort of switched gears and it's summertime and everything is okay and the, the ground isn't muddy anymore and and I think a lot of flood survivors just feel that they've been forgotten. Long-term recovery groups have already identified Vermonters in need of these items. They're expected to be delivered to those families starting next week. Now, Hope Coalition is also working on a long-term effort that's going to be repairing some houses within uh, parts of the state that were hit hardest by those floods. And that's going to be happening through the end of July. Roughly about 30 groups will be kind of rotating through there to help build and rebuild some of those homes. We're live in Berlin tonight. Adrian Pastor, NBC5 News.